So I have a question for you. When you go out, do you do everything right, but it just doesn't seem to work for you? Do you walk up to women and do you talk to them? Maybe you approach them all day long and it just doesn't seem to go anywhere. Uh, you go on dates, but maybe they don't call you back. Or when you're talking to a woman, do they tend to get disinterested and walk away, even though you're saying everything perfectly like the dating community teaches you? Well, in this video, I wanna talk about that specifically. I wanna talk about presence and I wanna talk about embodiment and what that really is. You see, recently I was asked what presence is and what embodiment is. And I think that's a really important topic, especially if you don't understand what it is and how powerful it can be for you and how it can radically change your life. So before I get into that though, I wanna invite you to like, subscribe and share so you don't miss any of my videos. I got videos coming out every week and I only wanna bring you the best content and make sure that you don't miss any of it. So again, make sure to like, subscribe and share and make sure to hit that bell notification. Let's get on with the topic. So what is presence? Well, presence comes back to embodiment. It's the ability to feel your body, to really be in your body. And again, what does that mean? That's another weird sentence. Well, for most people, they're actually avoiding all the feelings and emotions that go on in your body. Your body is filled with sensations. It's filled, your heart can ache, it can be sad, it can be happy, it can be joyful. Your, uh, your pelvis, where your turn on is, you know, when you get turned on, you feel all warm and fuzzy down there. Well, as a man, we can numb that out when we get around a hot woman. We can pull that energy back and shut it off. Our legs tend to relax and create a kinetic chain of movement and feeling down to the ground. Just like uh, if you hit a rubber band, it vibrates down. You can picture that. Well, the body is designed to relax and feel down and, and relax into the ground. And for a lot of men, we're tight and we're tense and we're holding in the legs, we're holding in the feet, and it kills that flow of energy, that kinetic chain down to the earth. As you learn to feel your body more, as you learn to connect to these parts of your body more, you actually create more presence. You create more ability to be felt, to be seen. When you talk to somebody with an open heart, they're like, wow, this person makes me feel warm and fuzzy. Now hear that. When you talk to them with an open heart, they tend to feel more connected to you. They want to know you more. When you talk to them from the gut, where you're really feeling the power of this, the gut right up here, and you drop into it, they tend to feel more courage, more strength coming from you. And we find that men that start to get embodied down into the gut tend to feel more powerful to women. And women, that's when women really start wanting to date them. They start to want to be your friend in the heart, and they start to want to date you in the gut. And then when you talk to them from your turn on, and you have the gut and the heart, man, you start to become unstoppable, super attractive and super uh, sexy to women. And this is often what's missing when men go out and use all the right pickup lines, all the right routines and can't make any of them work. It's not that these lines and routines are bad per se. It's that the fuel that drives them is missing. You're in your head, you're thinking, you're analyzing. You're working way too hard at this stuff. It shouldn't be that hard. You're designed to attract women. You're a man. So what this looks like in reality is if I tighten, like watch this right now, literally watch this. If I tighten in the jaw and I pull back in the head and throat and tighten and pull up and throw a little bit, I see this all the time. And I'm like here, hi, how you doing? My name's Brian, what's your name? Can you feel the, 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 the pulled back energy and the, and the disconnect? You know, um, you know, I just wanted to say hi to you. There's something about you. Or if I try to be really present and really masculine and I'm pulled back, hey, my name's Brian. What's your name? Where are you from? Oh, you're sexy. There's something about you. You could feel the disconnect in my, in my body when I do that. Now, let's say I learn to relax in the face and I learn to open up in the throat. My voice starts to come out and then I start to open my heart more. And what happens then is I'm like, hey, my name is Brian, how you doing? But let's, let's get out of the stomach now. I'm gonna pull up from the stomach. Hi, my name is Brian. Oh my God, it's, it's really good to meet you. There's a lighter energy to that. And that feels even better. You know, what's your name? Where are you from? But there's still a little bit of that upward sweet energy. As you learn to feel down into your gut more and you learn to get embodied in your power, then it's different. It's like, hey, my name is Brian, how you doing? There's something about you. I mean, look at you. You know what? I really want to get to know you better. And then as you start to learn to get down into your turn on, and you start to learn to move from lower in your body and you open your heart, it's a whole different energy again. It's, hey, there's something about you. I just want to meet you. Where, where are you from? Damn, 
you know, you've got something, you're damn sexy, you know that? And you might even blush a little bit because you can feel your heart with your turn on and that blush, that nervousness just becomes really sexy because you own it. So that's what embodiment is. It's learning to feel the whole core of your body all the way into your grounding. That's what my book, The Art of Fearless Seduction, is about the basics of understanding these principles of embodiment so that then you can connect outside yourself and connect to others. You can relate energy back and forth because until you can feel your own body, you can't give love, peace, and joy to a woman and receive it. You can't, because even if she tries to give it to you, you won't let it in. And you can't give your personal power to a woman, which comes from your gut, and, ha and then receive that inner, a response from her back, feeling your masculine power and being like, damn, that's sexy. Or your turn on, or you're or your grounding your ability to ground her out when she's nervous. These things that she loves in a man that all happen before you even say a word. And then as you learn to embody these more, as you go up to talk and communicate, she feels more of this lower energy coming from your body, this, this presence, this ability to look. And in this one, again, is another one, so we call it the conduit. This ability to control the flow of this energy, look at her, say hi, and really let her know you're talking to her from this core to her and back. Really let her know you're attracted to her. That's what it's really about. So if you want to understand this presence more and you want to develop it more and you've done everything to build this area of your life but it's still not working, this might be the key. This might be the thing. And if that's the case, definitely check out our online program. It's coming out beginning of January. It's a new online program. It's going to be covering a lot of releasing for dating, presence for dating, getting into what attraction seduction is with this presence. And we're going to keep going deeper and deeper into this in this product. And it's going to be a powerful uh, probably, in my opinion, one of the best online products for dating that's probably ever been created with lots of live uh, Q&As to go with every video. So if you're interested in that, definitely check out the link in this video. And with that said, remember to like, subscribe, share, hit the bell notification so you don't miss any of the videos coming in the future. Make sure to comment in the video. I'll be checking out those comments. I always check them out right after the video comes out. And remember, only the confident really live. I'll see you in the next video.